know, when I was growing up, I always thought I wanted an Airstream trailer for some kind of vintage, retro, cool camping. And then I saw this. This is a Bolus Road Chief limited edition trailer, and it's powered by two lithium iron phosphate batteries. It's got a solar panel and this amazing modern interior. It's like old school styling meets new fangled technology, and it's all to get you out of the city and off the grid. I'm here with Geneva Long. She is the COO of Bolus. And Geneva, I have to say, I love the interior of this. It's so amazing. But tell me a little bit about the kitchen. So the kitchen is awesome. We are in the Lithium Plus limited edition right now, and the microwave can run off the battery. And that is something that normally doesn't happen in RVs, right? It's the first travel trailer to be able to do that. Can I run the microwave and the air conditioning at the same time? You can. No way. Yeah. <laughs> So I can like cook up a dinner and like keep it cool while you at the could, same time. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Uh, so this on the road limited edition trailer weighs twenty three hundred pounds. Yeah, the limited edition weighs about twenty three hundred pounds. So how do you get all of that weight savings? We really focus on everything being lightweight mm -hmm. from the design up. We have an aluminum frame. We use uh, aircraft aluminum in all sorts of different places, and uh, even right down to the dishes, we focus on being extremely lightweight. Oh wow, these are like super lightweight. So everything is if it's too heavy, you just cut it. Exactly. We want to be able to tow with uh, almost any car and get into all those cool out of the way places. Now, I know you guys are towing it. What's your tow vehicle right now for this? We have a Bentley Bentayga towing <laughs> it here at Pella Beach. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, it's been great. But your normal tow rig for this is like a little four cylinder Saab, right? Yeah, we, you can tow it with uh, almost anything that's rated to tow. It's really exciting. Get it on to all sorts of unique places. So Geneva, I am essentially sitting in the shower. You are. <laughs> And I can take a shower indoors, like when these doors close, it forms a watertight seal. So there's actually a special shower curtain oh, you can okay. use that gives okay. you more room up at the top okay. and uh, filters the water nicely into where your feet are right now. Okay, but can I take a shower outdoors? You can. Ooh, that's so much fun. Yeah, it's, it extends out to the emergency exit and you uh -huh. can have an outdoor shower whenever you want. Okay, and then what about the toilet? Like, how does that, how does that work? So the toilet's a cassette toilet, which mm -hmm. is actually far superior to any other type of mm -hmm. toilet system in a travel trailer. You can empty it up into any toilet you can find and so you don't have to deal with anything uh, Oh, so I don't have to go to the dump station? You don't have to go to the dump station. Oh, so it's like nice and clean. It is, oh, yeah. perfect. All right, so Geneva, I'm in where the magic happens, in the bedroom. And right now it's set up for two twin beds, but is it convertible at all? Yeah, you can convert it into a king bed. Oh, so you just have a little insert. It's right? an insert right here. Okay, all right, so I got my iPad so I can watch my Netflix or my Amazon Prime, but then right. is there a place to charge any of those things? Yeah, there's a whole charging station in the living room for okay. any uh, laptops and tablets you might want to charge on the go. But what about if I need to charge the whole trailer? How do I do so that? So charging the whole trailer you can do in two main ways while you're on the go. Uh, one is the solar panel, which okay you can use to charge the battery indefinitely and the other is plugging into power from an outside source like at a okay. park or anything that might have power. And how long does that take usually? Usually just a few hours. That's crazy, that's so fast. Now I'm gonna be taking this off the grid but what if I need to check my email or my Facebooks? Can I do that? You can, there's a cellular booster in this road sheaf which means you get two more bars inside the road sheaf than outside oh so you can always be connected. Oh my god, I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. <laughs> And then how do I know that all systems are go in my, in my road chief? So the lithium uh, control panel is right here mm -hmm. and uh, you can see power that's flowing in and flowing out. And if I switch on the air conditioning right here, you can see it's starting to move. So what does all this vintage retro sheet cost you? Well, the road chief on the go powered by slightly less efficient batteries starts at $137,000. And this limited edition powered by the lithium batteries that's going to start at $219,000. But get your orders in now. They're only making 50 of these limited editions, and there's going to be a wait of 9 to 12 months. As for me, I'm going to go camping.